What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to basically tell you how to scan and repair in Battle.net. So basically for a game. So stick to the end guys. This will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys You would support my work on YouTube a little bit I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that So anyways, I would just say let's get right started So the first step in order to fix this kind of issue Or you basically not issue I'm gonna show you how to do that is gonna be to open up obviously your battle.net launcher So you're gonna head down to your battle.net icon or logo or just open it up and once you're there, we're gonna use, I don't know, let's use Warzone for that. So, or you can use whatever game you want or whatever you need to. So let's use Warzone. I'm gonna navigate to the bottom left corner of my screen where you're gonna see this play symbol and your game version and also this options uh, logo. So you're gonna click on that. And afterwards, you're gonna see scan and repair. So you, you need to basically just click on to scan and repair and the process will start automatically. So it will take a few moments few hours also a few hours i don't know and afterwards it's done yeah guys that's it for the video i hope that i could actually help you out with this video if it was like that just leave a like a comment or a subscription i'm gonna really be thankful for that i hope you guys have a wonderful day see you at the next one and bye